Hello and welcome to my Platforma development kit. My name is Emsat and I will show you how to use this helpful pack of game ready tools and assets to make your game a lot easier to create. Ok, let's get started. The first thing you need to do in your new level is to drag in the level start actor. You will find it in the collectibles interactables other folder, find the level start hole and drag it in. The red little arrow indicates where the player will spawn. Set the hearts amount and set the lives amount the player will have when spawned. Now let's find the death plane actor and drag it into your level. This plane will respawn the player character if he falls down the village. Move it below the playable area. Let's see how you set up the bridge and the lever. Go find the lever blueprint or the switch blueprint and drag it in. I will drag both of them in. Let's find the falling bridge actor. This is an animated actor and the red arrows indicate where the bridge will fall. Click on the lever or the switch and create a new array element. Select the actor you want to be activated. You can of course spawn more than one actor at once. As you can see in this example, I have three actors tied to only one switch. The locks are an easy setup too. Find the blueprint in your folder, drag it into your level and from the drop down menu choose the item required for opening the lock. You can show the required item in game above the lock if you want to. In game the locks will only open if the player has acquired the required item. And of course we need a way to finish the level so when the player reaches this hole he will automatically advance to the next level. Find the blueprint in the folder, drag it into your level and in this field type the name of the next level you want the player to advance to. In the drop down menu choose the item you want to be shown in the high score screen. In this case I chose the star blueprint. The rest of the actors can be freely placed into your level to your liking without any setup. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments section. See you next time.